Welcome back ladies and gentlemen to Dusk. Last episode we were in the floating factories. In this episode we just made it here. And it's real spooky. Alright. What is up with this level? That floating factory level in that last episode plus that uh, Big John boss fight that sounded like a uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger checking all these uh, things for secrets I have a feeling there could be a secret here or something my secret senses are tingling um, um, stuff is getting real guys this is getting real That was a secret? Really? Oh, anything up here though? No? Oh yeah, I can get up here. I don't know if I'm supposed to be up here, but... I'm creeped out. How about you guys? Wow, one shotgun shell. Yay, my favorite. I might have to go to the shotgun. Was there a door on the other side like that? No. It's empty wall here. But I have to click on it anyways. Just to see if there's a secret. Oh. Oh, dude. Oh. Oh, bro. Whoa. Too many dudes. I was like, I try to switch to the sniper rifle, the hunting rifle. Nope. And I hit the same weapon again. Oh, I know what you are. Wrong button. Got it. Oh, man, that wasn't good. 81 health now. Whoa. Whoa, bro. Back up. <laughs> Good thing I have a rating in my uh, description, right? Or people be like, "Oh man, what is that? Uh, what am I watching? Too much blood and gore and creepiness." Dodge, dodge. Got him. Kind of want to see if I can make it up in there. Secrets, something. Ah, morale. I need that. My morale was real low. I think that's the biggest morale boost you can get is diamonds. Just like my car, uh, the card life playthrough. I just found diamonds in there too. Check that out. If you want something that's more kid friendly. Family friendly, if you will. But who doesn't love old school shooters, man? Uh, these games right here are our style games like this I've been playing for a long time it all started with doom I'm that old guys yes I'm that old but you can't uh, fault doom that's a good game you know I haven't found the sword yet and I like the sword I don't want to step on these grates I feel like I'm gonna fall through all this ammo what so I just said I didn't want to step on those grates, grates and I just proceeded to step on those grates. Gotta check. I have found secrets within secrets before in here, so you have to check. Rats. Or Rouse. If you're a fan of uh, yeah, The Princess Bride. And who is it, right? That's a funny movie. Whoa, what was that? This mu music is very unnerving. It is real unnerving. <laughs> oh, whoa, bro. There you go. This shotgun suffices perfectly fine for those soldiers. 
Oh, oh, oh. I heard you. And I missed him. I missed him, man. Alright, you're all over the place, dude. All over the place. There we go. Wasting my shotgun shells. And of course, the double ball shotgun is better if you're closer you are, more damage that you do. Might switch over to this gun. There's plenty of ammo for it. Everywhere. Is there something glowing up there? No. Make sure you pick up your one shotgun shell at a time. The darkness is spreading. It is spreading further, further beyond. Rifle bullets. I don't have blue key. Sorry for the darkness. It's dark for me too. Go down, man. You guys are the failed experiment. What is that noise? Alright, being in these little tiny hallways is not reassuring, is it? What is this? Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, bro. <laughs> whoa. Boy, this, uh, hope you're not very claustrophobic. So these levels are getting under my skin. Running hole, running hole. Any more? Wow. So I've been staying as blind as I can. I have mentioned this before in this uh, in this game in particular because I've been waiting for it for a while. Now I've not played it because it's been available for a year or more, but I have not been playing it. And but I did hear on the because I followed New Blood Interactive on Twitter. And they, uh, like people are saying that they were really impressed with the third episode. Right now I'm still in the second episode. There could be secrets anywhere here, guys. I mean, anywhere. But just think how crazy the second episode is so far. And, uh, everybody's saying that the third episode is supposed to be better. I mean, really? What is going on here? Whoa. Is that water down there? Because. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Roll. Oh, uh, there's no fall damage. What am I thinking? Well. Ha! <laughs> That's how you handle them right there, guys. Whoa, where are you? Ha! Mortar time. I lost some health there, but hey, I'm doing okay. And I'm gonna quick save right here. Since I made it this far. My that one episode I titled it Be Kind Please. Quick save, I was making it was a joke on a old blockbuster movie tapes that you'd rent and it would say be kind please rewind if you were wondering where that come came from but I was trying to integrate it into the game what the what's the point of this hole oh, oh I just fell in I'm a noob hey he fell down too Where'd you go, bro? Come on. What? Oh, I see. He ran in this on this jump pad. So you make your way so make away make your way all the way to the bottom, just to go back to the top again. 
weird. Oh man. Well, that was a surprise. Got it. Been using the uh, machine gun a lot more in this episode because there's a lot of its ammo hanging around. What if you do an entire playthrough of just pistol? Is that a new area? It looks like where I fell down, but it's not because this is not open. Nope, okay. I just wanted to make sure. I feel like there should be, yeah, feels like there should be something up in there. Ah! Jump button, you failed me. Alright, we got the blue key now. On to more scarier things. Oh, jeez. And it fell down again. Sounds about right. You can use those uh, flamethrower guys. Pretty much as like a bomb for other enemy kills as long as they're close enough to the to the flame guy. Long uh, stairs or ladder. What's this green stuff? What the? Oh, it led back here. I knew that opened. I, I just had a feeling. Get back here, bro. I was watching other people's Let's Plays on, on YouTube, of course, you know. And, um, they were saying that... Ah! Ah! When they were playing this game, or not this game, but just any games in the last three years, and how they record the the episodes. Oh, well, oh, those guys do a lot of damn damage. But I, uh, back to what I was saying, it's like they say in their their episodes is how they record their videos to keep the audio separate where are you they um, record with a microphone like I do but when they record they like have their my, uh, computer or their console in front of them on a TV and the TV is muted so they don't hear anything in the game at all no game audio whatsoever like, how do you play like that? It's like, how do you play, do a let's play of an entire game and not hear the actual game audio? So I gotta listen to the whole thing, you know? <clears throat> but how I record is I have my, um, I have a microphone so I can talk and do my commentary, and I can hear the audio through my headphones. And. I use a, instead of using uh, Elgato to record my voice and the game audio, I use um, a digital recorder. Oh man, this is not looking healthy. Alright. Seriously, what is going on in this area? I'm actually getting some chills right now, guys. This place is crazy. Million soldiers. One at a time now. Why'd that guy fly away? What are they doing? You see him flying over? <laughs> That's just weird. What is going on here? Is this the portal to hell? Even though some people do consider that word hell as a bad word, but nowadays there's a lot worse out there. So if you do consider that as a bad word, because on my channel I try not to say bad words or talk anything political or racial or anything whatsoever. 
And if you do consider that, I am sorry if you do catch my video. I feel like there should be something back there, but there's an invisible wall here. Well, there's a wall there, you know. I'm trying to sound like Kronk from uh, Emperor's New Groove. I think I've thoroughly explored this place. But what is this, anyways? I mean, what is going on here? The visual, the visual thing here is just creepy. Kind of reminds you of Half Life Two, with the uh, <clears throat> the spire that's opening up the portal. With his sparks. We take from men that which has never been taken before. Um. I feel like I'm doing a mistake. A mistake. Oh. oh, it broke my flashlight. Oh, well, we're all in the dark, guys. We are all in the dark. Ooh. Double barrel shotgun. Close quarters. Oh, that's stairs. This is like super dark. Thanks for the uh, the mist. This cloud stuff. It actually allows you to see somewhat. Do I get my flashlight back? I hope. Because. Dang, guys. Um, are these explosive? My flashlight, no. Okay. Well, I don't know if they're explosive or not, but I'm bringing them in here. I knew those guys were coming. I knew it. I had a feeling they were going to make an appearance. Alright, where is this? Where am I even going right now? Um. Um. Maybe I should wait to go in there? What is this? Ah! Working flashlight. Saved. Now I can go back in whatever this is. I was in there. I'm like, what am I even looking at? It's too dark. The ruins held knowledge. We sold our souls for it. The music just ramped up, guys. Quick save. <laughs> Altars built of concrete. Fed with blood and bone. <laughs> Thanks for the health, bro. Um, door found with a radiation symbol. That's not a good sign. Um, what is this? The altar right here? Oh, what is this? You aren't supposed to be here. Go away. Ha! Easter egg. Found Easter egg. Might use this as my thumbnail. What do you think? You aren't supposed to be here. What does it look like here? Taking all kinds of shots so I can maybe use that as my Easter egg. You aren't supposed to be here again. Right. This music though. Um.
What? What? Do, I don't understand. Is the gore powering this? Like, they put all this gore out here. Electrified with this green electricity and it makes energy? Oh, I found the exit. I feel like I didn't explore all the way. Like there was something I'm still missing. Like the red key. I didn't get the red key. There was a whole red door back there. So am I, am I power, by turning on that gore machine, am I turning on this electricity even more? Oh, oh. Uh oh. This always freaks me out. I feel like I'm going to die or something. Hey, my flashlight didn't break. Yay! Scripted events got level. Alright, I'm thinking flashlight's got to be somewhere down here. Oh, there was a door here. Oh, that's a douche move. What happened here? Hmm. Where's that red key? I know I saw a red door back there. I'm missing something, guys. <laughs> Where is that key? That was the way out. I mean, I, I chose the exact way to go. That's usually like me anyways, right? I feel like I'm gonna fall off and die if I go that way. Well, because one of those a red key back there. Or there's one here somewhere there was a red door so this machine is being controlled by the gore or death or something can I turn it off why is this box here oh to get over you can just jump over huh Secrets. I'm at four of six secrets, guys. Four of six. Well, I think I'm gonna go ahead and go so we can make this a two ep two level episode. Can't take too long in one level. I missed two secrets in that level, so. All right, here we go. What creepy horrors are we going to run into now? Don't scare me like that. Oh, dude. At least they make noise, right? They make that breathing sound, plus... They have the blood spots that travel along with them. Is the military working for this cult? Or did the cult, like the military was, it came in to stop said cult and failed. Completely failed at their job and was converted to whatever this religion is. Here I'm coming up with story elements of a Doom type game. Everything has a story though, right? Those things are hard to hit. Dim rats. Well, those guys are healthy. Woo! It's like bullet sponge. You're a non-believer. Um, I hear them, but I... how'd they see me all the way over there? I was down here. Oh, they saw me up there. Okay, I see. It's openings.
Yeah, I had to try anyways, right? Um, do you have a nice flight? Whoop. Fell all the way down. What's that little ledge there? Yellow key. I feel like something like one of these should open. You know, I have to try. Well, only way we got is the crawly hole. Conveyor belt, looks like. I remember one of these at the earlier levels was a secret. You can walk through it. It was in the caves. Um, okay. I'm not going to say that out loud, but you can see it clearly. Whoa. I somehow managed to dodge those bullets. What was that? Oh, must have been this guy. There goes all my... Machine gun, yeah, let's stick with double barrel or two singles. Not wasting so many ammo, so much ammo. Oh man, I do not like them. I do not like them, Sam. I am. Yeah. Feel like I should use double barrel for this. Uh -huh. I do not. That's probably my, besides the invisible guys, that's my least favorite enemy in the game. They creep me out. They sound really creepy. They do a lot of damage because uh, they use the mortar, the pretty much the same mortar that you use, which is this gun. Um, let me just steal this boulder from you for a moment. I want to get this morale treasure treasure as armor what a concept it's only one point each I think or two but hey worth it now quick save oh man look at this place I can say that the developers of this game, which I do believe is just one man, by the way, I'll put his name in the description, but he, uh, really knows how to he give you that. Out and invited us in. Haha. <laughs> but, uh,. The visual, the how he sets up each level is like really cool. It's awe inspiring, you know. Even with these uh, old style graphics like this, the pixelate and whatnot, it still has a visual fidelity that's awesome. I mean, he did a really good job on this game, I can tell you that. I want to try out the other games that he made. Or New Bloods Interactive made, like a medieval. There's one. Still in a. Whatever you call it, early access. Um, I do have red key. That does not open. No red key back here or door. I keep forgetting where the doors are. Did, did I even find the door? Remember those yellow door back here? Red door. I got nothing. I saved that for big fights. We don't use this that often, so let's give it a, a shot for a while. You was not afraid? That means you were saying you were human once? And they converted you to? Or. If you are the big, the big meanie or the big, big bad wolf in this game, what would you be afraid of? 
if he's like if the, the voice that keeps talking to you is the boss of the game which I think it is what would he be afraid of because they are all worshiping worshiping you worship he I can't even say that word for some reason tongue twister death for me commentary ruined well that was a uh, fall of you know point of no return Oh gosh, I got stuck. That is not good having one of those in a small space like that. Got him. But they worship the guy, so I don't understand why he would say he wasn't afraid. What is he pertaining to? Exactly. I'm gonna have a hard time finding secrets in this level. Well, that was like perfect. I really do not like these things. Oh, blow yourself up. <laughs> Good thing they drop a health wherever so often. Well, four crossbows left. I'm not doing so good on the ammo again. Are these gonna drop ammo for me? No. You got a saw blade, though. What? How did I get into crouch position? That was weird. Ah. Assault rifle. They give you some pi uh, pistol bullets, but. Who wants to use pistol at this point? Like I said early on in Let's Play, who what's this? They've turned on us, or they turned mad us mad. So whoever these people are turned other people mad like the soldiers. Um I guess the warp point. That close to one of those bullet sponges, man, that's not good. This arrow? Haha! <laughs> Did it. And yes, I'm gonna quick slave. Quick What? What am I even saying right now? Kick. Quick save. After that one tongue twister, my whole brain has stopped functioning. I can tell you that. It has stopped functioning. If I was Windows right now, it'd be like Windows has stopped working. Cool. Yeah. There they go. Just use explosives. That's how you do it. Oh, my nose is itching something bad right now. I'm trying not to sneeze. It's really difficult. Quick save again. Oh, I'm back up here. Okay. I got yellow key now. Let's see if I can make my way back. We know the blue key's back there. Oh, the blue door. Well, they take a beating, don't they? I heard. <laughs> I heard gooey bits. I blew up that body instead of the instead of the living enemy. Ow. Man, I just got that super health not long ago, dude. As soon as you get super health, you just it just does not last. Alright, making sure I got all the ammo back here. Um, 
I do not like these jumps where it's like a no, no way back up. What's these spikes? What is this room? Well, don't know if I should even try to go down there, guys. I don't. All right. Quick save then. Do it. Whoa. You want to lead me to some super health? Some morale? Yes, you are. Ow. I was trying to switch guns and it was the wrong time to do it. Well, these levels are getting dark too. Every level's been like this. Just dark. So, what you do? You stare at them, then you go backwards, but baby steps. So, it forces them not to hit you. And if uh, they try to swing at you, you just keep doing those baby steps until you're out of range. There's that red energy again. Ah. What did I get? Health? I want break. I want loot. There it is. Nothing at all. My favorite. I feel like I'm about to bash my head on these and cut my scalp off or something. Yeah, so we'll take that ammo. I'm full already, so I don't use it as often as I should. Um, what is up with this? I don't even remember my first episode for some reason. I know it's I know I found dope fish. The ongoing id software dope fish. Oh, oh god. Oh jeez. Son of intoxicated. Intoxicated. But you hear that in the background though. There's one of those uh robotic women things that shoot rockets. Ow. You want this? This guy's a lot tougher than the big toxicator. Gotta watch out for splash damage, just like any other game, especially Doom, Doom style games. What is that? Oh, I hear you. Oh, I hear you. That is creepy as heck, guys. Oh, jeez, the twins. Good thing I was quick saved a little while ago, right? <laughs> well, there goes my health. Run, 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 run. Run away. Now my health is up again. I'm wondering, are these uh, considered secret bosses just like intoxicated was kind of a secret boss in the early early on if I can say that correctly already what no that was that, that can't be then there's no way back I missed this entire level guys well I chose poorly Shoot up in there. Man. Yeah, I chose poorly. I shouldn't have walked into the teleporter. 
Well, I know I missed everything in this level. Well, two out of six. Four secrets missed, and a couple enemies missed, too. It was kind of a short level, but still, all those secrets. The gauntlet. Well, this sounds promising. Alright, well, I'm at the end of this video. We did two levels. We fought some bosses. And now we are in the gauntlet. And I'm going to have to save this one for later, guys. Well, well, if you'd like to become part of the Meerkat Nation, hit that uh, subscribe button. Join today. I need all the help I can get, guys. And if you like my commentary, you find it helpful, funny, or entertaining, hit that like button to show you support. And if you didn't, still hit that like button. I'm still learning. And I'm improving every day. And next time, subscribe button, you'll see a notification bell. You hit that notification bell, you'll be notified of everything that I upload every day so you never miss all these awesome videos. Well, I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.